Hi, my name is Todor. Here I'll give you an overview of the latest session in my course, Rig Anything with Rigify. In this module, we'll rig this guy, a two-headed ogre. I call him Bo and Joe. This is Bo and this is Joe. Rigify makes creating the basic armature really, really easy. That will allow us to discuss more interesting techniques. One of the main topics will focus on is achieving good deformations in the whole body and for that we'll use two main techniques. One is weight painting. If you don't know much about painting weights, you'll gain plenty of experience points in this series. The other technique is creating automated bones. For example, here you can see some bones in the pec area that act as muscles. Not actual muscle simulation, but just an approximation created with normal blender bones. And the cool thing about this technique is that we don't have to manually animate those bones. I just move the arm and the additional bones move automatically based on the rules that we set using constraints and drivers. Here, if I raise the leg, there are bones that automatically raise the belly up. I think that's pretty cool. Yet another area is adding props and clothing to the character. So you'll learn how to add the pants, this wrist armor, etc. And we'll even automate the behavior of some of the props. For example, this shoulder armor. Without any automation, it will clip into the body and even worse, the spikes will just pierce through Joe's head. But after we automate this prop, it will try to avoid the head on its own. And we'll also work on rigging both heads with two Rigify face rigs. That is not possible out of the box due to a limitation in Rigify itself, but we will find a workaround. And we'll make all of this work seamlessly within the Rigify rig. I think you'll learn a lot and rigging will become fun. I hope to see you in the course. Feel free to contact me if you need help or just to say hi. My email is open. And we also have a Discord group that is becoming more and more active.